Hey, let's start this video off with a moment of silence for the logo. Let's get a moment of silence for Uncle Jerry West. This 100 card they gave him, 100 overall card that they gave the logo is powerful. So if you know money spent, you got a super hit rock out of that. I want to say happy Father's Day to all the fathers out there. They got a bunch of Father's Day Evo cards out here. We're going to learn how to get straight to them in this video. They got a bunch of agendas out there for these Evo cards. It's a lot of Evo cards. At the end of, at the end of this trek, if you do grind for these Evo cards, you'll have a bunch of MT left over to get some of these packs. You know what I mean? Pop a 10 pack out of this pack market. Either way, we're going to get to the agendas for these Regal packs. This Goat James, we're going to talk about this Goat James real quick. I'm going to go out on a limb and I'm going to say that Goat James is pretty much a sham. Yeah, 2K hit us with the sham guy with this one. I mean, okay, Goat LeBron James, we can go to Goat LeBron James right here and we can compare him to his Gladiator card. His Gladiator card is not too much different. Minus three. Minus three to the Gladiator. The Gladiator is minus three from the GOAT. So if you have the Gladiator, I'm I'm not going I'm not gonna hold you. You might be able to overlook GOAT James. Okay, 2K, you you had us good bait with with the Wimby. The Wimby situation was good bait, but this situation right here is not too much different. If we look at the signature styles, there's not too much difference. He has De'Aaron Fox, he has John Wall. It's still Trey Young Escape. Uh, the step back is still John Wall. But the crossover and the breakdown are different. It's plus three. It's only plus three in the upgrades. As far as badges, the badge difference is different. There's better badges on this new card. But I'm willing to say that most of these badges are upgradable anyway. So you can badge out your 100 overall Gladiator LeBron. And he'll be pretty much the same as Go James. If we look at... If we look at any other LeBron James from this set, we look at 100 overall LeBron James from this set. I mean, the badges, it's a he has a few better badges, a few better badges. The animations, a couple of better animations. No, the 100 overall looks like it has the exact same animations as the Gladiator LeBron. And then it's the same difference. So 100 overall LeBron is Gladiator LeBron. So if you have if you have Gladiator LeBron James, you straight. You don't really need to pull these. You don't need a better card or anything. That's if you have 100 overall LeBron James, though. Point guard, small forward, Gladiator LeBron is pretty much the end all beat all. If we go ahead and look at Dark Matter LeBron, I mean, 40 Hall of Fame badges, 36 gold ones, 96 three point shot, 99 drive and dunk, 99 defense. The defense is looking good over here. If you can get one of these Dark Matter LeBrons, you'd be in, you'd be in the game. You'll be in the game. I mean, I'm not going to, I'm not going to mince words. I'm not going to hold you. The animations, I guess they're the same. I would have to put them side by side. I didn't put them side by side, but those animations don't look too bad. I'm not going to hold you. Uh, I want to put him side by side with his Galaxy Opal. Galaxy Opal versus Dark Matter LeBron from this GOAT set. 20 Hall of Fame badges. Okay, okay, it's a big upgrade. It's a big upgrade. Galaxy Opal Bron is 161 behind Dark Matter LeBron. So, I mean, that's a big jump. That's a really big jump. I'm not going to hold you. I'm going to look at the animations, though. What's the difference in animations? Yeah, yeah, it's a, it's a big jump. Galaxy Opal LeBron is, ugh, it's some boobo. That's some bookie whoop. You don't want that. Goat James versus All-Star James. All-Star James has Trey Young Escape. That's tough. All-Star. So they gave, they gave GOAT, Gopal James, LeBron James Escape. But the All-Star has Trey Young Escape. That's dirty. That's dirty business. Y'all know y'all could have given Trey Young Escape. As far as the, okay. All right. So the attributes are all the same. Both of these cards have the same attributes. The only difference is Trey Young Escape. And a couple of badges, maybe. Well, one badge. I saw one badge in there. Okay, so the new LeBron has catch and shoot on Hall of Fame. Big wow. But as far as these animations, it's crazy that Trey Young is on. So if you have 
honestly, if you have all-star LeBron James, you don't even really want to run this Gopal LeBron James. This go Gopal is not going to be, as, I mean, it's just not a go. It's just not a go. All right, now I want to look at this 97 overall LeBron James. 89 three-point shot. That's some ugh. 20, 20 Hall of Fame badges, 45 gold badges. That's crazy to me. This is this is a no-go. This is a no-go. You don't want that. Mm -mm. Anyway, we out here. We get into the to the the music, the theme music of it. I told you what we getting into. I low key want to look at this Ray Allen, and I want to look at this Jimmy Butler. Now, if we take a look at Ray Allen, he looks like he's got some big upgrades. Ninety nine three point shot, ninety seven ball handle. Yeah, the deep. This car is looking okay. This car is looking okay. I want to put him side by side with Leap Year Ray Allen. Let's see what he's talking about against Leap Year. 149 attributes difference. That's crazy. Okay. The jumper. Oh, this new, this new Ray has Kyle Corver lower base. That's going to go crazy. Steve Francis signature size up. Trey Young escape. Oh, no. Okay. Yeah. This new Ray is going crazy. The moving step back is on pro, but that's okay. That's okay. It has, he has Trey Young escape and Kyle Corver's uh, lower base. That's going to go crazy. So yeah, Ray is a beast. Ray is going to be a beast. Uncle Ray Ray just got to upgrade. And if we put this Jimmy Butler side by side with his older Jimmy, his Eclipse Jimmy, oh, 163 attributes. That's crazy to me. I mean, it is a 100 overall card. The, it's going to be the signature size ups for me, though. What is the signature size up? Jer Derek Rose. Derek Rose and Trey Young escape. That's different. I, I was feeling like, okay, well, it's still, he still has Steph Curry moving step back. That's tough. That's tough with the same jumper. Uh, I mean, it's an upgrade, though. It's definitely an upgrade. So, obviously, the best card out of this joint is going to be Gold LeBron. But at the same time, if you have 100 overall LeBron, you good anyway. I wanted to take a look at, at Lamar Odom. He's one of my favorite guys out here. So, we're going to look at him. We're gonna look at Darius Miles also, and we definitely look we definitely gonna look at 80. Darius Miles is looking like some garbo. 89 three-point shot. They could have did they could have did Darius Miles a little better. Why don't why don't they ever get his man his his flowers? Like, like why can't Darius Miles get his flowers? That's crazy. Jared Allen and Chris Bosher. Who is Chris Bosher? I don't know him. A lot of pro in these. Yeah, I mean, it is what it is. 52,000 to get that joint. It is what it is. Lamar Odom, did they do him right? 315,000 and get, bro, we got to go see what that lock-in set talking about. We might need to uh, get a lock-in on this. You know what I mean? We might want that. We might want to see if we can get that GOAT James. 95 three-point shot out of bro. He looking all right. Big bro looking all right. I'm not going to lie. Um, Trey Young escape. So they they throwing Trey Young escape around, like I mean it's just it's just regular at this point. Pro step back, it is what it is out here. Forty Hall of Fame badges, thirty four gold ones. Okay, um, Anthony Davis the one hundred overall. Anthony Davis, ninety seven ball handle, ninety seven passing, ninety nine everything else. It is what it is. Fifty seven Hall of Fame badges, eighteen gold ones. I'm seeing Trey Young escape. I'm seeing. Pro moving hesitation. I'm seeing Giannis crossover. Giannis moving crossover is cool. Chris Paul's moving step back. I don't know about that. Nikolai Jokic on the hop jumper. Pro two laner. Yeah, that card. I, I really hope I can pull, bro. I'm not going to lie to you. I really hope I can pull him. But, I mean, let's get back into what's what. What's the what's what? We got, we got MT and VC. We can pull some packs. But I don't know if that's what we're doing right now. Honestly, I want to get into this player market. And see what this lock in is gonna cost us. That's four hundred and ninety three thousand and five hundred MT in order to lock in this set. Or you can go for the discount for one hundred and ninety nine thousand. That's basically two hundred thousand VC. But um, ain't nobody got time for that. Ain't nobody got time for that. <laughs> and then here we go with the part that I've been waiting on: the grind time of it all. Let's see what it takes to get to these regal agendas. 
all right, now we need to get 50 points with any LeBron James over multiple triple threat or triple threat online or triple threat online co-op games. That's 50 points with any LeBron James over multiple triple threat games of any caliber. Cavalier wins, win a game using five Cavalier players, get 50 rebounds with Spark players over multiple games, get 50 assists with Laker players over multiple multiplayer games, score 61 points with a Heat player in a game, get five triple doubles over multiple games, and then complete the Regal Spotlight Challenges, and that'll get you a deluxe Regal Pack, as well as all of the prizes that you saw within this grind. Yeah, I mean, that's cool. That's cool. But to be honest, we wanted to get to these uh, Father's Day joints. Let's see what these are talking about. Okay, now you got 13 days to get these done. Match Winston Garland's career high and score 31 points with any Darius Garland in a game. Match Harvey Grant's career high and get 16 rebounds with any Jeremy Grant over multiple games. Make one dunk with a Pacer player in a game make 10 dunks with path to all-star glenn robinson the third over multiple games make 15 three-pointers with any steph curry over multiple games evolve cooking seth curry get five blocks with any nicholas claxton over multiple games get 22 rebounds with any al horford over multiple games and make 30 dunks with freaky gary payton the second over multiple games f-a-n he a 69 god Freaky Gary Payton, the second. Come on now. And then the Father's Day 2, the second set. Match Michael Thompson's career high and score 40 points with any Clay Thompson in a game. Match Rick Brunson's career high and get 14 assists with any Jalen Brunson in a game. Match Jaron Jackson's career high and score 31 points with any Jaron Jackson Jr. in a game. Make five four-pointers. Make five. Can I speak? Make five four-pointers with any Steph Curry over multiple clutch time offline or online games. Evolve legendary path Dale Curry. Score 10 points with any Jet Howard over multiple games. Score 47 points with any Andrew Wiggins in a game. Score 32 points with any Andrew Nimbard in a game. Get seven double doubles with any DeMontis Sabonis over multiple games. These are going to be tedious. These are going to be really tedious, but not impossible. Not hard to do at all. The hardest thing about these Father's Day is probably going to be first acquiring all of the cards that you need to do these joints and then maybe evolving that Seth Curry and evolving, evolving that Dale Curry. That might be the hardest thing. That might be the hardest thing. The most tedious part of this process, though, is definitely going to be acquiring these cards in order to uh, like if you don't have some of these cards, it's going to take a little bit of MT to get your hands on these cards. Definitely. And then let's step over here to the playbook because, you know, we got a new poll. How many Sparks cards have you earned from agendas? I know I have at least seven plus. Let's see if I'm right. Let's spin this wheel, though, and get this drop. Hopefully we can get a. Uh, oh, it looks like it's only base packs on this drop. Base packs and like 200 MT. We got a base pack. I think we got a base pack. That might be 250. Okay, yeah, we got a base pack. Cool. Cool business. Um, Yeah, we got seven plus. We got 15 spark cards. We've been on our spark journey. We've been journeying around here with these spark cards. 13 days left in the season. And I mean, for good measure, I want to go ahead and open, open a little pack pack. Honestly, honestly, we're going to do a whole pack open video. Let's go ahead and just open this base pack right now for here. And then maybe a single. We might open a single out of LeBron Goat. Who we get out of here? Nothing. There's nothing out this base pack. We get a Fred Van Fleet. We can send him to the uh, the nether. Send him on to the nether because we do not need him. We got a Vortex pack right here. And then we got this 10 pack option card pack. We got an option pack. Let's see what's out of this Vortex though. Let me get that one Hundo Luca. Let me get that Hundo Luca. Nothing shaking out of a deluxe pack, really? Okay, we get another uh we get another big man. I don't know his name like that. Pujaveski, Aleska Zaskazasku. Add him to the exchange, to be honest. Um, we could throw him in this deluxe pack. We we need a 
we need a pink diamond in that deluxe pack. We still looking for that Wimby. Like we want a dark matter or a go Wimby. I'm not going to hold you. Out of this though, let's see what we can get out of this option pack. Who would y'all pick? Let me know in the comment section. Who would y'all pick? Who would you pick out of this option pack? Out of these optionals. Why do they put bold cards? Okay, well, I mean, okay, yeah. Well, the bold cards are passed. So if you didn't get your hands on some of them, that would be your chance to actually get your hands on the one that you want. Um, honestly, I think I'm gonna take I think I'm gonna take Jonathan Isaac out of here. I think that's who I want. I don't know. I mean, okay, it's gonna be between Jonathan Isaac and Chris Weber, I think. But I also think that maybe I want to take this Vince Vortex and just like get the MT off of him just to like maybe open more packs from these new cards. Cause I'm thinking I might just sell, I might start selling cards because I don't, I don't know if collector is going to happen. I don't think collector is going to happen like that, but, um, I mean, you never know. Let me, I'm weighing my options as I'm talking and I think, but then at the same token, you never know with 2k, like these could just, I don't know. I don't know if I can get what I want off events, but I'm going to try it. I'm going to definitely, I'm going to try it. I'm going out on a limb. I'm going to try it. I'm just going to step out on faith and I'm going to try it. So I can get 45K for Vince. Okay, cool. Or I can add to the exchange. Actually, I can add to the exchange for a deluxe mega pack or I can take that 45K. I think I'm going to take the 45K VC. MT, I'm sorry. Yeah, let's go ahead. We're just going to step out on faith. We're going to take that 45K. We got 260K. So the next video should be a pack opening. We should open up some packs and see what's what. If you got anything out of these GOAT LeBron James packs, if you got anything out of here, let me know in the comment section what you got out of these Regal packs. If you're, uh, if you're going for a collector level still, let me know if you're close to that. And then also, I would like to know, how your mama doing? How your mama, mama doing? No, I'm, I'm messing with y'all. Get out of here. Like the video. Subscribe for more of this. Your booze mean nothing. I've seen what makes you cheer.